Track and field consists of several disciplines, including throwing, jumping, sprinting, and distance. Sprinting requires form and technique, along with speed and stamina. In order to build on these abilities, the boys track team has hired Coach Facity, a new specialized sprinting coach. Coach Facity has numerous accolades and previous experiences with track. He is a former All-American in the 800 meters and holds school records at Cherokee High School. He has lots of ties to the Lenape Regional High School District, with his mom working at local Hartford Middle School and his dad working as a science department coordinator at Sequoia. Coach Vasidi's family ties to the district were one of the main reasons he wanted to coach at Lenape, along with his willingness to stay around sports after his running career was over. In the future, he hopes to achieve a teaching job in addition to his coaching position. Well, sports have always been a big part of my life, specifically track. So I knew once I was done uh, performing competitively, I knew I wanted to coach and get involved in that. Uh, specifically Lenape, I am, my mom is actually a teacher at Hartford, so I knew I would be coaching a lot of her former students, and I thought that was a pretty cool situation where that's not normally the case. Coach Sean McEnany is the head track coach. He has taken many student athletes to big track meets to compete against the fastest high school athletes in the country. Coach McEnany has been the head coach for two years and also has previous experience as a runner, posting a 420 mile time. Coach McEnany played a direct role in the hiring of Coach Vasidi and the accolades of the former All-American are what stood out most during the interview process. He had experience as a runner at Cherokee High School, so I was interested in, in looking for a coach who has experience within our district. I knew he was a successful runner at Cherokee. He set a couple of records. I was part of good relay teams for Penn Relays and, and in, in states. Coach V kind of fit that mold the best uh, he showed the most interest in the program. He showed a lot of good experience. And uh, he looked like he would be somebody that our runners would, uh, would work well with. Both coaches expect big things from the team and look to guide the runners to not only become better high school athletes, but possibly have a chance of pursuing a career in track after high school, such as college or for intermediate track clubs. They both believe that a track coach plays a big role in the development of a runner, and they both follow similar coaching approaches. Uh, so the first plan is to help uh, the athletes achieve things that they never thought they could achieve before. Um, but the main plan is to work with the coaches uh, and to, prove, to improve the, uh, the program for this year and uh, the future years. So I think there's three important aspects for a good coach in track. Uh, the first being caring. You have to care for all your athletes. Uh, number two is knowledgeable. You have to be knowledgeable on what you're talking about. And three, consistency. So I will always treat all of my athletes the same, whether they're varsity or novice, uh, and I give all of, my, all of my athletes the same amount of time and same amount of effort uh, with everything I do. Really what I'd like to see most is our youth, our, our younger runners, our younger throwers, start to show growth and improvement, um, be more competitive in the, the dual meets and some of the, the big invitationals on, on weekends for track. Coaching and, and track is interesting. Uh, you, you do a lot of the background work, you help the athletes train, you help the athletes with, with even small things like diet and weightlifting and, and all those things kind of, you hope, uh, you know, accumulate into a good race or a good performance. The boys track team has lots of talent and with the coaching of Coach Vasidi and Coach McEnany along with the other assistant coaches, the runners have found a new energy and their times are decreasing. We would like to thank Coach Vasidi and Coach McEnany for their contributions to our story. For Tribal News, I'm Nick Morris. Now back to the studio.